That's dangerous to unmute me. <laughs> I guess they didn't unmute me. Hello, everybody. Sorry about that. Yeah, all this is new. Some days we make mistakes. Some days we do fine. Tonight, we thank you for joining us here at the Oklahoma Indian Festival at our Meet the Artist event. Tonight, we have Brandy, and she is joining us. Hi, Brandy. How are you? Hi, I'm good. So what have you been up to lately? I'm just setting up our new studio, and we've been doing a lot of feather orders uh, from our last event that we did with the Oklahoma Native Fest, so that was awesome. And that's okay. kept us very busy, so we're very, very appreciative of that. Keeps you busy, doesn't it? Yes. Good, good. So what other things do you got going on? I saw something else that you're getting ready to do something really big, taking a big step. Yes, so uh, we are set to open. Oh, wow. <laughs> what are you opening? So we'll have a, um, a stained glass studio where we'll continue teaching classes, which we've already done for the past year or so. But now we'll be able to sell supplies. So oh, that's, a, that's a lot of help because I had a hard time getting supplies. So I know that my students were too. Well, oh, good, good. So tell me a little bit about, now, first of all, how do you say, is a Geechee? It's a Geechee. A Geechee. Uh -huh, so it kind of reminds me of Etsy, you know, and everyone's got that down. So I'm hoping that a Geechee will, you guys will pick it up. Just say it up. A Geechee, a Geechee, a Geechee. There you go. Thank a Geechee. You time and you'll have good luck for the rest of the day. There you go. There you go. So we've got a few people jumping on here. Let's see if we can get a few more. I'm going to do something here in the back. I can't wait to really hang that sign up. I bet. So when's a big day? Um, we are hoping for the 15th. Uh, you know, just depends 15th on of this what, month. Or? Yes, 15th of this month. We're not going to start our classes till June because we want to make sure that it's safe. Right. And it, you know, it's, it's kind of early. So um, we have a family too, and we want everyone else's family to be safe and we want our family to be safe. Yeah. I mean, you definitely want everybody to be safe. Yeah. We, we love our students and we miss them terribly. And so really looking forward to everyone coming back and seeing the new studio and cause you know, it's for them too. So, right. Yeah. I love to open those doors and get everyone in right now. It's just not, we just can't do that. But we've been pretty busy, staying busy and staying focused. And uh, this, you know, doing things like this, this keeps us busy and it, it's been really good. Good, good. So um, something else about Agichi that is, what does that mean? Oh, that Agichi is my mother in Cherokee. My mother. Mm -hmm. And so why did you name it after your mother? Um, my mother, I say that and I kind of laugh because I am a, one of five kids. So she's not just mine, but um, <laughs> I've always been like my mom. So they're like, whatever. So uh, she does stained glass. And what's cool is that she does stained glass with her mom. So my grandmother did stained glass and her and my mom enjoyed doing that together. 
and me and my own daughter, which you guys see, she's not. She's showing up tonight. Actually, she is here. She's online. <laughs> so anyone that voted nay or yay, you all won because no, she's not here. Like I'm at home right now, but she's online. I think she's online. Right? Online watching or Haley, are you there? Is she? She should be commenting. Let's see. <laughs> I have not seen her comment. I have Ronette saying hello, Tanya, Belinda. Renette, Renette wants to know when your store will open. And um, after the 15th, if we get our, our okay to open, um, you know, for those that have compromised immune systems, we just, pre and just really anyone, you can call us and you can schedule an appointment so that okay. it's just you and you're not in there around other people. <laughs> so it's okay. And we do have a phone number and we're starting to add that and you can text it as well. Oh, good. So we're, we're updating as we go and there's a lot to it. <laughs> but it's, yeah, it's I mean, when you started to launch this business, launch it was just right when everything okay. hit, wasn't it? And we, yes, it was. It was like we signed our lease and we got in there and started working, and all this happened. So, so we're, can't we're it. we just make the best of it. And you guys have been awesome to help us do that. We appreciate everybody that has been supportive. We couldn't have done it without them. Oh, good. good. Gigi is very, very, very thankful for all this ongoing support that we've received. Oh, good. And, you guys have been very helpful getting this off the ground, too. I mean, when I decided to do this, you're like, yeah, sure. I'm getting <laughs> So, let's see. Well, we have a lot of really great followers, and they're doing a really great job. And um, they share, they do all kinds of stuff. It's just awesome. Yeah, yeah. Anything else that we need to know about, Brandy, that's going on? Well, um, if there's anyone that wants to maybe add an addition, maybe this. Oh, this that's pretty. A butterfly garden ornament. And you can win this, but if you can spell a Geechee, the tenth person to spell Geechee correct on the comments is this butterfly. On melody, I have to. So of course you realize you have your name on yourself, so they're gonna see that. Well, then that should be easy. <laughs> yes, it should. It should. So we've got a giveaway going on and you've got your classes. Do you have your class schedule up, Brandy? Um, we did. We just started loading it today on Eventbrite. So, um, and we will, we'll get it shared to Facebook. We just want to make sure that, um, no one thought that we were opening too early. You know, those classes that are all on there, they are until June. They're for June, July, and August. And um, there's only six people per class. So if you want to get in there, now's the time. Um, we are doing a special through this event. And it is, you can uh, get on Eventbrite and you put in a code. And the code is Igichi Live, all capital letters. And that will save you 15%. And okay. that is going um, for about 24 hours. And we'll get that in the comments too, so that people can grab that code and save a little bit on your classes. I know your classes are well worth it too. So, yes, thank you. Mm -hmm. And and they are. Our tables are six feet long, so that works out pretty helpful in doing our measurements. So, um, everyone has their own work area. There's not any sharing. Everything's cleaned before and after each class. Which those are practices we already did. But now we're just double checking the cleaners that we're using, you know, 
and making sure everything is keeping everyone safe. And we do ask for now that everybody wear masks. And if you don't have any, we will have some for you. Oh, good. And good. Um, we have now supplies, glass, and we're still making pieces. Uh, I cannot wait to get everything. We still haven't moved all of our big inventory over. Uh, we're very lucky that uh, we've been able to keep our glass and our larger pieces um, at the Stone Church safe during all this transition. And when we get that um, moved over, then we expect to see some bigger things. Um, I love the feathers. I'll always make those feathers, especially, you know, around this time, it's Mother's Day and, you know, those mm -hmm. feathers are special. Graduation. I love your eagle feathers. We've got a question. Um, mm -hmm. Did you say your website? Could you say your website again? Uh, the website is thegeechee.com. And on that website, you can access the Eventbrite, which is what we use to do our class tickets. So um, you should be able to access anything. And if you have any questions, you are welcome to private message me. You can email me. Um, we started adding the phone number. And you can also text if you're a texter. Now, are your classes beginner classes or intermediate classes or both? Both. Mo the majority of our make and take classes, they are beginner friendly. And the way we have it set up is that everything's beginner friendly. But even if you're advanced, everything's there. If you want to make a garden ornament and you decide that you want to cut out a cardinal, if you think that you can do that in the time that we have, mm -hmm. go for it. We're very open. We want everyone to be creative. And I am just fascinated with my students' pieces. I mean, I love to do stained glass, I, but I'm more fascinated looking at everybody else's stuff. So anytime a student makes a piece and they post it, I'm just like, oh, that's so awesome, you know? <laughs> and this piece yeah. behind me is a piece that my mom made. So oh, this is gorgeous. one of the only pieces that I have left um, that were hers. And this is probably one of the largest pieces that um, we have in our family because she moved around like a gypsy. So yeah. that, very beautiful and we hope to start making larger pieces like this also so definitely uh, stay stay watching we have a lot of really fun stuff and lots of things coming up so obviously we're not you're not doing any shows but you are actually doing an online show this Saturday yes there are no so you'll be here with us on Saturday for the mm -hmm. Oklahoma Indian Festival, May 9th Market Day, along with about, mm, I think about seven other artists. Yeah, and, the group is growing. It is growing. And um, so, and this was started actually, I started this as a way to give back and help our artists community because everybody was seeing shows cancel and you may not realize this, but the artists this is a big bulk of their income being in these in-person events, things like Mayfest that's canceled or um, let's see, Down Sulphur, the Chickasaw Nation had their big event later in May. That's been canceled. A lot of artists were planning on being there. Um, so, so many events have been canceled and artists yeah. who need a way to make up that income they were expecting that income and need to pay bills and you know they rely yep. on this it was and decided to try something new and here we are all learning so yeah <laughs> this has been a lot of fun um i've really enjoyed these meeting artists thing and more um watching the other ones not so much <laughs> get to see their background meet them and yeah, and, and again, yeah. just because we miss each other, that's one of my right. favorite things about doing booths is, is not just, um, definitely well, not the setting it up yeah. or tearing it down, but it is getting to see all the people and the other artists. I just, I love the other artists and I, I love all the people. They really are, it really is family. This artist community is really is family and we all miss each other and you know, we don't always get a chance to chat even at shows because if it's a good show, we're so busy. It's like, 
you know, you're just running back and forth. And now we actually get the chance to people can meet and tell us, tell us one interesting fact about you, Brandy. Um, Not too interesting. Keep it, keep I don't know. I think everyone pretty much knows everything about me because I don't really hide anything. Mm -hmm. I have a lot of kids. <laughs> <laughs> And, um, you know, and what's great is, you know, Agichi is my mother in Cherokee. And yeah, that was about, you know, my mom and, and growing up and seeing my mom and my grandma do that together. But um, I had no idea that it would end up being me and my daughter, too. So and she has really um, put a lot of faith in me to to spend all her time and dedication and setting up for our new place. So. It's, right. um, she's a talented um, Tanglass artist herself. Yes, she's doing great, especially when I just leave her alone. Um, but uh, I don't know. I can say uh, all 50 states in alphabetical order. Okay. I can spell them. Um, I'm a horrible speller. <laughs> That's an interesting fact. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and my phone can't spell either. So. You know, what's up with that? Yeah. Like, I didn't need any more help not being able to spell. And then my phone makes it even worse. It really is my phone. Good. Um, so, trying to think. Uh, some of my students, if any of my students are watching, because I did, you know, post a thing. I have gotten a couple of things I'm seeing on my phone. I can't Haley's answer. On, by the way, I just got a message that Haley's on. Oh, well, I'm trying to... Uh, access everything but i do have a couple people notifying me that for whatever reason they're not figuring out how to get on so um you know do comments show after this goes on they youtube will, they will yeah and if they comment on youtube it's not live on youtube but it'll be i'll upload it later tonight okay and, um so well, 24 hours so so we'll get that uploaded to youtube later tonight and um Cooking what? This what is, is a little stained glass so you don't eat it. You know, so it's cookie. And what mm -hmm. it does is we hold this with our hands when we're grinding and it saves our fingertips. Because usually oh. my fingertips are all sliced and ugly. <laughs> this is a finger so saver. You're going to carry stained glass. You're going to carry glass and stained glass supplies in your store, right? Yes. And for mosaics, because we love our mosaic artists too. And um, some glass fusing, which we also have a glass kiln. So we're excited to pick Ooh. that up too. So we're always willing to learn new stuff and just keep going with the flow. And yeah. this has been a hard time. So... You know, we, we might even have a few spots um, where if someone needed to hang their artwork up for a little bit, I wouldn't mind doing that. Like a gallery wall or something. I've got some open space. Okay, that's good to know. Um, yeah, all kinds of classes coming up. And um, in the future, our own more artwork of ours, larger pieces. This year, I just, I just want to go big. This year is... Go big or I don't want to go home. <laughs> We're just going. Go big or go home. I love home, but I don't have my glass here. He like made me put it all over there. So. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's every artist's dream is to move it off out of their house, but then you move it out of the house and it, if you have, leave everything behind, you can't go home and work on things. No, but you got to start separating it. And, um, you know, and a happy Mother's Day to all. Yes, you Mother's Day there. is this Sunday. Are you taking the day off? Nope. I am. <laughs> I don't even know how, what to do on a day off. Um, I'll probably sleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We've all been so busy. Uh, usually I just kind of go and go and go and then I'll just crash and sleep it off and then I'm up ready to go again. 
I don't know how everyone puts up with me, but I appreciate it. And I'm very thankful for everyone that has contacted us and checked on us. And, and I've seen some people come by and peek through the windows and, you know, just the hearing from people and hearing that they're excited is, um, it's really awesome. So really appreciate everyone. Look forward to meeting even new people and yeah. Will there, you, do you do any mosaic classes? Huh? Will you do any mosaic classes? Yes. In fact, uh, we decided it's going to be called Mosaic Monday. Oh, I like that. that sounds confused with Manic Monday. Right. Just mosaic Monday. So mellow. Mellow mm -hmm. Monday. And, and kids can do that. So we yeah. are going to open up to do more kid activities because uh, kids are fascinated with stained glass. Probably because they like to, my opinion is they like to break stuff and it's glass. But <laughs> it is <laughs> it is shiny and it's pretty and uh, kids love stained glass so we wanted to yes, do yes. things that would be more kid friendly uh, and with that you know that's why we are also going to be a or we are a um, what's the epic charter school vendor oh okay so kids could take class there and mm -hmm. it counts for school credit Yes, yeah, so the little kids, they can do the mosaics, and they can even do some of the glass fusing that we'll be doing, and then as they get older, you know, kids kind of bad, just depends on their skill level, where they are, and um, they can start learning stained glass about 12, um, you know, the program that I did just recently with uh, the Operation Art 2020, mm -hmm. um, that, I miss that kid, <laughs> he was he was just awesome. He had never even hardly heard about stained glass. He had seen it, but he didn't know how it worked at all. And um, I got to work with him and we made the owl together. And I just, I think he's awesome. And that's why I was like, man, I, I want to work with more kids. Because when he started soldering and he was just like, whoa, you know, that's when I was like, oh, you know, I want to do that some more. I want to hear that some yeah. more. Okay, so um, to wrap up with Brittany, because we have another artist who's actually in the waiting room waiting to come on, and we'll bring him on here in a few minutes. Um, Do you know, interesting fact, what? That he is my neighbor. The other artist, I bet you he doesn't even know that. He does. Accidentally, I was not one time. They get to <laughs> small world so to wrap things that's your interesting fact there you go to wrap I mean, I things my face too much yep to wrap things up brandy has got um a couple offers one was a free what was that butterfly garden ornament Ooh. if you spell a geechee you're the 10th person to spell a geechee right in the comments you will get this free she will even ship it to you so you do not have to be local you can be anywhere in the country and get that and then um, she'll be opening her studio here. So you need to follow her page on Facebook, find her website, make sure you've got that bookmarked. Also come back on Saturday and see all the stuff she has. Cause she'll probably be set up in her studio on Saturday to show you everything she's been working on. Right. No. <laughs> so to be in. Yeah. yeah. So. We will, with that, we will bid Miss Brandy adieu and say wado to Brandy. Wado! Wado! And we'll be back in just a few moments with Brian. So thank you everyone for tuning in. Thanks, guys. <laughs>